Today, we're diving into a common issue many of you have encountered, and that's getting your photos rejected or not uploaded when you're trying to add them to your Google business profile. It can be super frustrating. So let's get straight into it and how you can troubleshoot this problem and what you need to know and understand. So first off, if your listing is brand new, and I'm talking like less than two weeks old, you might face delays publishing images because you're so new and Google needs to build a little trust for you. So it's a little bit of waiting game. In that scenario, you might just have to wait and try again after maybe 10 or 14 days. Have you had a recent suspension or have you recently gotten your Google business profile reinstated? If that's the case, you'll also need to wait a bit longer, around like 10 or 14 days before Google's usually going to allow you to publish photos again. Now, if your image is a repeat image, so meaning it's already being used and you're trying to add it again, that could just be the case. Or if it infringes in copyright, both of those are a no-go. So your image will be rejected straight off the bat. So it could be those reasons. Now, interestingly, sometimes your image might initially show as rejected, but if you just give it 24 to 48 hours, it might just get published. So again, I know it's frustrating, but you might just need to wait a day or two to see if it's actually fully rejected. Now, here's the other thing. If you have uploaded spammy images before, Google might have put your business on the naughty list, which is going to make it tougher to upload new photos. Now, that's not going to apply to all of you, but you'll know who you are and just understand it's probably going to take a little bit longer and Google might just not accept photos for a little bit while if you're on their watch list. Now, let's talk about quality issues, too, because this really matters. When you're uploading a photo to your Google business profile, your photos need to be high quality, not blurry, and they can't be excessively large. You also need to keep the text and overlays to a minimum, ideally less than 10% of the image. So if your image is covered in a bunch of text, Google's not going to like that either and probably reject it. So make sure your image is under 1500 pixels in a JPEG or PNG format and preferably smaller than 500 megabytes. Now, don't forget about AI search guidelines too. So a lot of people are generating AI images now and trying to add those to their profiles. That also could be a problem. If you're unsure if your photo passes the test, I'm gonna put a link in the description below where you can check by uploading your image and then just see if it passes, okay? So that link's in the description. Now here's a pro tip. Try uploading your photo as a user instead of a business owner through Google Maps, right? So if it gets approved there, your photo is fine. And if not, there might be an issue with your profile or the photo. So that's another kind of thing that you can try to see if it works. Just sign in with a different Gmail account that's not associated with your Google business profile or have your business partner or coworker try to do it and see what happens. Now, if you tried all of these things and you're still facing issues, come back, leave a comment below and link to your photo, whether you have that photo already on Facebook or somewhere else. We'll just take a closer look and I'll see if I can help you figure out what's happening. So that's all for today. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe for more great Google business profile tips. And we're always helping you optimize your profile to get found and get new customers. Leave a comment below with your experience. We'll see you in the next video.